Hi guys, my name is Kevin and I've been stuck at 35 subscribers for a long time now. So, if you're watching this video, please can you subscribe to my channel? It's really great if you subscribe. And but if you don't, you witness the other side of me. We're just talking right now. I'm gonna place this goat, and you got until this goat slip out of this uh powdered snow. To subscribe if you want to save the goat the goat was just added to minecraft 1.16.200.52 so i placed it you got you see the goat is going down oh you guys just please subscribe so that it will stop his madness uh oh no it didn't stop it oh no oh uh, i think i've made something wrong uh, it, it not doing Okay, I need to help him. I need to get the water. I need to get the water. I hope you guys have subscribed. If you guys have subscribed, the water is going to work and the goat won't die before I do this. Please subscribe. I hope, it, I hope the goat doesn't die. I've placed it. Okay. I think my game is lagging because I turn on the experimental gameplay. I need to actually turn it on to play with this update. Uh, the water is on it and it's... Oh, it just turned the lava off. Uh, the goat is still burning, but why? Uh, uh so, okay, the goat is alive now. So, okay, let's get into the video. The video is about how to turn your Minecraft Pocket Edition to Java Edition, and you can't actually like turn it to like Java Edition. I'll show you how to turn it to Java Edition with no mods and or add-ons on your phone. So. First of all is the, you know, the circle stuff that appears on your screen. The circle stuff. And, oh, I added the goods to the game. There is a link in the description to the video that you will, that there is another link to download the, the update. And if you download it, turn on the experimental gameplay and I will show, I will show you that later in the video. So, let's talk about the touch. Uh... Wait a second, then let's go into the settings. Oh, uh, if you didn't see this touch very well, this is it. You can see the weird looking circles on the screen. Yeah. So let's go to the settings. Settings. So if you are in the settings, you have to go to the controls setting. Controls settings. Then you touch you touch the touch settings that's kind of weird then you turn on the split control you can see that yeah if you turn that on there's going to be a plus sign on your screen like the java edition so you know anywhere the plus sign is pointing it breaks it and my game is lagging because you know experimental gameplay isn't that smooth yeah so now What's the second one? Okay, which I'm, which one I'm going to talk about next? And uh, let's change it to survival mode. I need to change. I need to change it to survival mode to tell you about this next thing to do when you want to change it to Minecraft Java Edition. And that is about the hearts, which are not showing right now. Uh, okay, they showed now. Since they showed, I want to show you how to make your heart bar, you know, on the left hand corner and your hunger bar and all those bars to be on top of your experiment bar. There's a lot of bars. So, now, you go to your settings again. But this time, instead of going to the control settings, you go to your video settings. Like you say, it's in the general. So you go down to the last part of it and change it to classic. It's usually in pocket, but you change it to classic. So after doing that, you can see that your heart goes on top of your experiment bar. And this is not all. This is not the only thing this thing does. And it changes your inventory menu too. And you can see it's different. You know, when I was looking for the water bucket, it doesn't look like this. Yeah, it changed it. It makes it look like Java Edition. So the next thing I'm going to be talking about is how to make you know every touch stuff on stuff. Oh, and right here I'm trying to change something. 
and I'm talking weird because I didn't record this video with voice and now I want to show you how to turn on the outline selection and you can see there that the you know the stuff the blocks light up so I'm going to show you you know Java edition it gives a black outline but bucket it doesn't so you go to your video settings again then turn on the outline selection if you do that you're going to show the outlines so you can see that it's now showing outline around the stuff you are pointing at you just have to touch your screen and it will break it like how we do it in the normal one uh, the, my game is lagging a lot so and now uh now i'm going to show you something that is not really in java but a bedrock thing that i don't think a lot of people know it's about the paper doll like the you, you see a lot of settings in minecraft and you don't know about them so if you turn you see this settings are losing i paper doll but if you oh my storage was disturbing so if you turn off turn the i paper doll off it shows like a small mini character of you if you crouch it shows it if you are swimming it shows it and if you are flying creative mode it shows it but if you are just walking it won't only if you are sprinting that's when it will show it uh, so i think yeah and uh -huh, for the for the download in case you download my the update and you have to turn on the experiment mode you have to turn on the cave and cliffs so that the experiment if you turn on all of this your game will be lagging like crazy like if you hit a mob it will take like forever to come down and it takes like forever to load your game i don't know why yeah i think that's all for this video thanks for watching bye and this is my previous video yeah this is the previous video and i told you i record this after i made the video i didn't turn